also finally learned that Seth's name. I want to learn about hey, hey, organ trading. Hey, people, Maxor here. Hey, hey, people. Seth here. Is this... Can, should I develop my own hey, hey, people? What should I say? Hi, hi, people. <laughs> I, I think I cringe too much. I can't do it. I'm sorry. The entry to this one is a little spicier than normal. Am I going to get in trouble? It's probably fine. Give me your address and I can teach you about the organ trade. <laughs> Hello, people. Hi, hi, peepsters. Loomster here. <laughs> Guys, please. I, my audience is not all 12-year-olds. You get away with everything? True. Hey, hey, Loomy here, looking for gold, the Loomster. <laughs> Hi, guys, virtual VTuber, Kanika Loomy here. You guys like that? Do you like the corporate voice? Hello, welcome to the video. I hope you have a great time. You like that? You like it? You like it? No? No, you don't like it? <laughs> hey, hey, woman here. You don't like it? <laughs> It's the anime voice. This is what your anime dubs sound like. This is what an anime dub sounds like. Ah! Wait, wait, wait. What's a... What's a... What's a... Wait, wait. I gotta find a... Fuck. Let me find a, a quick anime dub line. What's an anime Seth dub line? Here. Oh, shush, 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 shush. Shut the fuck up, Seth. I'm sorry. That was rude. Uh, anime... Famous anime dub lines woman. <laughs> Wait, wait, I want the worst dub line ever so I can read it. Uh... I'll take a potato chip and eat it. No, that's not good. Uh... I need a line. Oh my god. Do you like a chicken sandwich? Women aren't real. I love chicken sandwich. Ghost story dub. <laughs> These jelly donuts are great. Pikachu, I choose you! I gotta stop doing that. I'm making myself sick. I'm so sorry. I am... <laughs> Just make that line from S2 Overlord where the lizard goes, Impregnate me? No. <laughs> Wait, where's the pit court here? Here. Here. Everyone loves this one. <clears throat> Let me get some BGM on so we can feel really immersed. Ready? <laughs> so as a joke, I went to my friend's house while wearing Pecora's wig and clothes. I could barely stop my laughter as he went red as a tomato and looked at me from head to toe with a bit of drool in his mouth. The way he stared at me made me feel a bit funny too. But I decided to tease him more by taking off my clothes. He asked me, are you serious? And I said, Yup, Pekko. He went silent for what seemed like forever. So I asked him, What's the matter, Pekko? He said, He's confused. But then his boner got really hard, which made me take off his clothes. I expected him to scream stop as I kissed him and stroked his cock, but instead he shouted, Oh God, Pekora! Which made me get a boner myself. Before I knew it, I was blowing him for the first time till he came. His semen was so thick it got in stuck inside my throat and no matter how hard I swallowed, he then said, I want to fuck you now. And seeing that we've already gone that far and we were both naked, I obliged. A few hours later, the jerk went all pale and said to me, why did we do that? Now, now I'm not fucking straight. But he looked so cute, all confused like that, so I just took pity on him and reassured him while wiping his cum off my face. Let's just pretend I'm still Pecora. There you go. Are you happy now? <laughs> happy? Are you happy? Is everyone good? <laughs> you don't like my anime dub voice? Why don't people like my anime dub voice? Hello? This is the anime dub voice! You're mortified? Dies from cringe? I need bleach? Do the Pippa Feet one? What? <laughs> I've never been more disappointed. You fucked up part of the delivery. Read it again. God damn it. Please undo the last five minutes. <laughs> the voice was the least of the problems? No, it was the voice that made it cringe, no? <laughs> okay, let's watch this. <laughs> 
I want Pippa to make me come with her feet. I don't under I don't know the full copy pasta for that one. Actually, it's kind of sexy. The voice not the. You're not allowed to like anime dub voice. This channel is for sub only, okay? <laughs> Dubbed anime is cringe. Sub anime only. All right, let me let me just purge the last five minutes by uh, watching Seth, please. I need an ice pick lobotomy. You can have Seth instead. Here you go. Hey, hey, people. Seth here. Welcome to a little game I got gifted a couple months prior. I'll be real. I don't pay for games. I just put on my LED Thank you, Kaya for the 15. and get everybody don't to be see. my Discord daddy. This is the best investment in 2022. This doesn't just pay you dividends. It pays you salaries, other people's salaries. Oh. Disclaimer, I am in no way affiliated with the Chinese tar factories that make these. That would be lame. On the other hand, if you a Latin American or Middle Eastern militia looking to expand your service, Services, hit me up. 45 second integration doesn't sound like much, but I assure you that's a lot of stolen AMV footage that I can crossfade into footage of your men wearing turbans. I can also do a full dedicated video where I can quickly summarize the fine points of your proposed ah! benevolent regime, namely the peaceful transition of power. I got given this by a dude who originally I assumed to be deaf until one day he said he wanted to VC and I said no. No, you can't. Your kind doesn't have that <laughs> capability. Well, now I feel stupid and he thinks I'm racist. Space <laughs> Warlord Organ Trading Simulator is a glitch. Thank you for the Pimes of Numb 287. Yours, and everything is a commodity, including <laughs> yourself. That's the joke. It's actually right now. God yeah, I'm pretty sure the former patriarch of a Rothschild family who received nine heart transplants during his life really cared to make sure that every single one of them were ethically sourced from the nearest Malaysian child. So what's the difference? The difference is that in this game, I can publicly list a little boy's heart on the stock exchange so that we can speculate against the value of little Joey's heart. It is a unique perishable good, which is already <laughs> hedged against hyperinflation owing to the fact that there's only one. To begin, you have to start the game. To begin the game, you have to click start inside the game. After picking a persona, you begin. As stated by the intro, you're above the morality of anybody else. Everybody has them, everybody needs them, and everybody wants them. Organs. Which means they need you. You're an organ trader, and this is your universe. Everybody else just lives I in it. I want to play this you're game. Still at the mercy I really want to play this game. Someone else. You're not free, you're indentured. Everything you've been given <laughs> is borrowed. Hello, and if you don't play nice and give your handler what he wants, he's going to remind you that everything ever given can be taken away <gasps> one piece at a time. He's What's it called Jesus. when you ask for something? Suggestion. What's it called when you ask for something while pointing a gun at their head? Persuasion. Mentor is going to repeatedly persuade you to choose life over death by forcing you to take non-negotiable contracts which by their very nature are designed to make you broke. This is the equivalent this of is going like to a jewelry game. store with an invoice for one dollar in exchange for everything inside. But we'll deal with him later. You begin the game and you'll notice it's very calm and quiet because that's not the game. When you push that red button, the market opens up <gasps> for exactly two minutes. In that time, you gotta go fast and you gotta go hard. Oh. 120 seconds of pure stress. That's the game. But this is only the start. Early on, Stop. contracts are your bread and butter. You take them, you fulfill their requirements, and you get paid. With payment comes money. With reliability comes reputation. With reputation comes problems. Because the bigger you get, the more they start to notice. <laughs> Namely, everyone else they're smarter and faster than you they're unpredictable bipolar and obsessed but most of all they're richer than you imagine a teenage girl whose bloodstream is nothing but cocaine and benzos armed with a single corporate credit card which has an overdraft of 700 trillion this is your competition <laughs> good luck if you're too slow they're going to take it if you're too fast you'll buy the wrong piece because they bought something a millisecond earlier shifting the position <gasps> of each item if they need oh. it they'll take it if you need it they'll take it anyway just to spite you so how are you going to play this guy at the start you get offered a little training course on high speed organ trading i sincerely recommend you take this is there a reward at the end a little tangible reward for my simplified kumar erectus brain <laughs> no, you learn how to read barcodes. Every organ on the exchange has a serial number. This tells you everything about the organ in the shortest span of time. I'll break this down block by block. Organ code, size, condition, blood oh type, quality, and special properties. Why do these matter? Because as you get more reputation, your clients 
get more demanding. It's no longer a stomach. It's a large stomach. It's no longer any pair of lungs. It's a pair with the same AB negative blood type. And I will not settle for a shitty thyroid. Get me one that's <laughs> absolutely perfect. Pristine. Get me that one in a million mythical thyroid that shoots out thyroxine so fast. You're going to live at like... This sounds like a mid student's nightmare. It seriously feels like, like you were a mid student. You played this waiting. game. You learned body parts so else. fast. Now that you can read... You can trade right? real fast. It's a market as diverse as your clientele. Contracts and include, but not limited to, medical supplies, <gasps> ship repair, warlord training. I <gasps> saw some fucked up shit and popped my eyes. I need a replacement. <laughs> I am currently depressed. I need a new brain. My favorite VTuber told me to get in on this pump and dump. I can't lose. Would you be interested in resurrecting a dead god and ending life in this universe as we know it? Yes! Please let me know. I can't pay very much. Um, necromancy work is not unionized. Uh, it's been a subject of union busting for years now. Your options are plentiful. Now, we have to talk about the soundtrack because it's the best soundtrack I've ever heard. Because it's not just a soundtrack. It's layered like a cake. Every single track is layered by the menu you're currently on. So, in the process of high-speed organ transfer, you automatically create a melody just by trading. Due to the nature of the soundtrack, it doesn't actually exist, but the guy who made it remixed the whole thing into an experimental companion soundtrack. I first recommend you play the game and then give it a listen. I don't have a fitting modern word for this, so I asked everybody younger for an appropriate expression I could use to convey my enthusiasm for the music. Here goes. It's bussin'. I really like it. I'll put a link in the description below. Later I on, really you like get it. access to organ stocks. Because, really, why even buy <gasps> organs when you can really speculate? It's a perfect simulation him. of stock He's dead to us. We lost him. He's gone, boys. <laughs> Said he's gone. There are rules to the organ exchange. But it's there is boggy. One oh, which I've taken directly from Rothschild himself. Be greedy <laughs> when others are cautious. Be cautious when others are greedy. To put it simply, everything look a little too good? Sell that shit, homie. Market correction is coming. And once it does, oh. buy the dip and repeat until you become a multi-millionaire. And then, just like me, you're gonna be fined several times in a row on fraudulent charges by corrupt <laughs> officials and lose the game. I'm not even joking. Blink twice and it's game over. That's how quickly it all goes. That's the ADHD experience of life every day. Wake oh up, God. scream, and die. Except here it's a lot more dramatic and I'm currently competing for kidneys with my arch nemesis, who is, of course, a dog. So, <laughs> I don't really know where to take this metaphor. For. Eventually, you're also gonna get a better cargo hold. You'll figure this out on your own, but essentially, organs interact with other organs. <gasps> your cargo hold is alive. It's an inverted body you can graft oh. organs to. I see nothing wrong about this. So, instead of relying exclusively on contracts, you could also buy a high-value organ like an appendix or a pharaoh gut in very poor condition for very little money. Strap them to a bunch of healthy hearts, pump them full of blood, and flip the newly rejuvenated meat for massive what? profits. Finally, some contracts so are special. Cool. You'll recognize them by the border. Pursuing I see them absolutely no endings. moral Remember, complications in this. Well, this is all ethically sound, morally and perfect. offers to take the toxicity out of your relationship by luring Mentor out into the open and turning him into a flesh painting that cannot die. That's a good ending, by the way. One of the bad endings is when you actually try to help. I'm not gonna spoil what it is, but here's a hint. One of the tracks in this game is called A Galaxy of Children Who've Only Seen Red. There's a bunch of endings, and I think there's 10 in total. The current copy might have less, but I'm playing an early test build oh. because I have a profound relationship with a lord, or because I <laughs> talked to the developer. The lord, he simply watches as I trip myself repeatedly and blame every everybody else. P.S. If you're slow and decrepit and past your prime, which for a man is about 14 years of age, <laughs> there is an accessibility option to make the game slower. Now, if he only added hotkeys for accepting, fulfilling, and deleting contracts, my life would still be painful, but slightly easier. I actually talked to him about this, and unfortunately, it can't be done that easily. Just like Super Mario 64 was originally going to release with pregnancy mode enabled, at the end of the day, it's a limitation of the engine. Final score. I give Space Warlord Organ Trading Simulator an impractical out of 10. I love this game, but classic organ transplantation will never be a viable method of long-term organ replacement. I'm sorry, but that's an immunological reaction. And tissue from anyone else. Immunological. Well, he really knows his shit, huh? Result in tissue rejection. Yes. 
I'm aware we can take immunosuppressants so we can kill them with a tumor instead. The oh. only real way forward is understanding stem cell differentiation to grow your own tissue that will not be rejected. Space Warlord Organ Trading Simulator. There's a reason I like it so much. Because it's the perfect human duality. You get what you give. You sell pieces of everybody else. But the taller you stand, the harder you fall. And one day, it's all gonna come crashing down. You're gonna lose your money, you're gonna lose your life, and when you're dead, they're gonna chop you up and sell your pieces. And they killed because Major in this Alex. Case, the sum of the parts really is greater than the whole. Ultimately, the organ trader really is selling one thing himself. It's a nice little game. It's not too long, but that's really a matter of perspective. You don't know how short your life is. I thoroughly recommend it. Oh yeah, by the way, you can mod this game. I messed around and it's pretty easy to add new organs. Ironically, the first organ I oh added my God. is usually the first to be taken away. Oh Where my God. can I buy this game? Everywhere. It's on every platform, on every store, except the Chinese store. Hopefully, by the time this comes out, there's a discount on Steam. Of course, you can also get a hundred percent discount depending on your life circumstance i even recommend it and we both know exactly what i'm talking about <laughs> robbing an atm at <laughs> two in the morning mandalore retired and gave birth to two beautiful boys the story continues <laughs> oh my god Give it back. <laughs> what organ was that? Hmm, I wonder. Did you know the biggest organ on the body is skin? Yeah, but I, I did hear that Seth was a... In pharma. He, he did something in pharma and then he was disillusioned by it or something. Let's watch the devil may cry. <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys watch them on, on your own. I'll let you guys watch them on your own. They kind of link to each other. Maxor links to a bunch of people. Seth links to a bunch of Maxor.